Hi Pisces, welcome to weekly reading for Thursday, November 21st, 2019. One more shuffle for you, and I'm just going to jump right in. All right, I hope everyone's doing great today. Um, your first card in the what is the Four of Cups in the reverse. You've been bored. You might be meeting new people. You might have turned something down. Um, someone might have made some type of romantic offer and you weren't interested. You, um, you wanted to be single or this could, this could be a job as well or um, just something general in your life. But you turned something down. You, you could have been bored with it, and you wanted to, um, you wanted to meet new people. All right. You also might have untrapped yourself from something, something that you were stuck in, and now you're free from it, and you can meet new people. All right. Let's see, the how, chariot in the upright. You, you might have literally um, had to break out of something, like with a lot of force, going against the status quo. Um, you might have been promoted. You could be doing, uh, you be, could be in a new job. You could have left something that you weren't interested in that was boring you. You went out and found something new. You put a lot of energy into it and and you, you got something better. You feel very in control, very um, like you're taking charge of your life. Some people might think that you're, um, oh, what is that called? The when people, um, they can't be happy for you when you're successful because you know they're they're still trapped. So they they have a hard time being happy for you. Because this can also, um, in the reverse, it can mean arrogance. I'm not saying that's what you are. I'm saying that your happiness or your success might be rubbing people the wrong way, like people that are you know not as evolved or not fulfilled. This is a very unfulfilling place to be, which is what I'm picking up that that's where you were, but that's not where you are anymore. You're putting effort into something new for sure. Um, in the why, 10 of cups in the upright. Wow, well that's, this is for love, this is for family, this is, this can also mean you're going somewhere away from home. This can also mean travel. So you could be traveling somewhere to break out of something. You're, you could be feeling like you're in a bit of a rut and you've put major effort into something that will make you very, very happy. It could be, um, you could be going, moving. You could be moving far away. This can be moving for love. This can also um, really, your family might not be happy. You might be moving away from um, your family of origin. See how you're gonna feel. Queen of Cups in the reverse. You could be emotional. You could be um, sad. But you're going to be happy. You know that if you go through this period of um, grieving, sadness, that you're going to be very fulfilled in the future. It's like, it's almost like a sacrifice that you know you have to make to get this, this happiness. This, this is bliss. This is, this is everything that you ever wanted. This is um, a very good card, but it, it does indicate an unhappy family as well. All right, let's see what your advice is. Chaos in the upright, take control. 
This is a very strong person. This could be um, a boss. This could be a father figure. This could be someone in law enforcement. Someone, um, someone who has authority. So to me, this is saying take control. Continue. You already are. You can tell. Um, continue to take control. And this arrogance end of the card is pointing towards this. This is the emperor in um, in regular tarot. So it it could be saying Pisces that you should actually you know be a bit arrogant. Like this is this is your life, right? This is a very strong person, um, someone who knows what they're doing. Taking control of your life. All right, let's see what the bottom of the deck is. Three of swords in the upright. Mental clarity, heartbreak. Could be heartbroken about something about your family, about your family being upset. That could be breaking your heart. But you also have mental clarity. This is detachment as well. This is also being separated physically, um, which goes with this traveling. So it, it, it looks like a, like a bittersweet goodbye to me, Pisces. It looks like, um, like you're turning something down. It just wasn't fulfilling. You're hightailing it out of there, like with major, major effort for your happiness, you could be moving. You're sad, but you're doing this so that you will be happy. And this is definitely all about that. Um, you're taking control. Your advice is to, is to maintain control. Keep, keep this, this, it's like super energy. You could also be um, cutting people out of your life that aren't supporting you the people that are mad at you, or maybe they're judging you, something like that. Well, that was your reading, Pisces. I hope that helped you, and your shuffle song is called Priestess, and this is the Shura remix, and it's by Puma Rosa. All right, I love you guys. Have a great week. Bye.